What's up YouTube? This is Demkeys back again with another Unity tutorial and today I'm going to teach you about the static variables in the Vector3 class. That would be, sorry, those would be back, down, forward, left, one, right, up and zero. These are basically shorthand versions of, uh, let's say for example, in 3D world space if you wanted to step, uh, step back one unit, then you would write Vector3 and that would be 0 along y, 0 along x, sorry, that would be 0 along x, 0 along y, and negative 1 along the z-axis. Rather than using numbers, you could just type vector 3 dot back. And the same goes for down, forward, left, right, and up. If you want to write 1 along uh, x, y, and z, you can just use vector 3.1. If you want to write 0 along x, y, and z, then you can just use vector 3.0. So I'm going to demonstrate how to use uh, how to use each of these variables. All right, so what we have here is a plane, a cube, and a light, and our camera. I'm going to remove this script which is already attached and I'm going to create a new script call this direction script 01 excuse me if you hear any sounds in the back I got a new computer table and uh, some of its parts are making some squeaking no noises so Sorry about that. All right. So first thing you want to do is create a move force variable that will be a public float. Next, create an if condition that will check whether let's say the w key has been pressed. And then to move the cube, we would use transform.translate. And generally we would well, if you don't know about the static variables, then you would type new vector 3, 0, 0, um, 1. And then multiply that by move force. Or uh, some of you might just use move force over here. Rather than doing this, you can type vector 3 dot forward multiplied by move force and this will give you the same result let's try this out I'm gonna set the move force to 0 0.2 and now let's run the game you can see when I press well, you can't see me pressing the keyboard. When I press W, then you can see that the object is moving forward. And if you look at the Z value over here, you'll notice it increases by 0.2 each time. I can do the same thing. I can use the same method to move it at the back. I can do the same thing for moving it left or right. And I can use the same thing for moving it up or down. Sorry, the same method for moving it up or down. Wait, why is this still going left? Sorry, I forgot to save the script. Let's try using vector 3.1. Let's see what the result is. You have a diagonal sort of motion 
it's moving in a diagonal direction. Um, vector 3 dot 0 you would use it in cases where you want uh, let's say we want we have placed our object somewhere in 3d space and uh, the position along x y and z axis are uh, 2.8 6.4 and 12.5 let's say we want to bring this to exactly zero exactly the center of 3d space we can set the position that's transform dot position equals vector 3 dot zero now when I press the W key it comes to the exact center of the 3d space so this is how you use the static variables in Vector3. These can be really useful and they can actually shorten your code in many cases. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Do check out these other videos as well. The video on the top left teaches you how to use the line renderer. The video on the top right teaches you how to use lens flares. And on the bottom left is a playlist for the Unity 4.6 UI Tools series. I'm also accepting donations, so if you would like to help me out, you can send your donations to my PayPal email address, which is mentioned on the screen and in the description down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave your comments below, and I'll see you guys next time. Is he quo? Is he fame? Is he even still the same? Claiming laws, boys, but we never seen him main. I don't cover now on album when he get the chance to hang. Like, damn. One, three, four. Niggas acting like I never been through them doors. Moved uptown and I rocked a little red. Niggas asking if I'm raw cause I'm out in Hempstead. Like, shit, who are you? Entourage member or part of the crew? EMG.